back to another episode of the God of War Ragnarok commentary walkthrough. Yeah, that's a big mouthful. And we are in Alfheim st still. In the desert. And we are just doing some side quests, gathering up some uh, goodies, and just basically getting ourselves in all kinds of trouble. So let's get to it real quick. If this video helps you out at all, leave a like on it. It would be greatly appreciated. And if you haven't subbed to the channel, please do so. <clears throat> we're trying to hit 500 by the end of the year, and we are um, we're getting closer. We're getting closer, and with your support, I'll be able to keep doing this and provide a variety of videos for everyone, and I just, you know, appreciate it. It's awesome. Nothing costs a thing. All right, so that's a nice, easy little puzzle. There's a couple puzzles. There's a, a pretty challenging boss fight. And a couple pieces of armor to be found out here. So you definitely want to stick around and do all this stuff. There's some random treasure chests out and about in the desert. Two or three of them. I don't remember exactly how many. But there's one. Stop and grab each one, I'm telling you. You will not regret it because... Every extra penny you have, you know, hacks over, is one more piece of equipment you can upgrade or one more thing you can buy. You might be a little bit short for something. Yeah, you don't want that to happen to you. Don't be that guy. Here's another little vine puzzle. Tons of these vine puzzles. These can be a little frustrating. You know, you really got to sometimes step back and uh, check things out. I can play beautifully, you know. I do not. I would prefer it remain that way. There we go. First time. Wasn't that easy first time in there. The trick is to just get it lined up. Be standing in the right spot and let it roll. Once we're done with this area and we get back to Sindri, we're going to hit Sindri up before we have to fight the little mini boss because he may be a mini boss, but uh, his danger level is high. Definitely not somebody you want to mess with if you're not physically ready for it. I believe he's no, not right up in here. This is uh, this is a bunch of those annoying. Oh no, it's not. This is another mini puzzle here. Okay, this one. Oh my god, this one sucked. Look, even that's hard to get. All right, this one requires you to be like nice and close. And just in the right spot. Um, like I said, just in the right spot. There we go. It's a little too far left. And yeah, every bit of these resources is hugely important. there was another chest around here. There might be. Mm, not there. Alright. Now this up here is a berserker grave. You don't want to mess with it. I mean, you can't mess with it anyway right now, but that's a, that's a boss fight for later. The berserkers are, are the Valkyries of this game. And if you play 2018 God of War, I don't know exactly what I'm talking about. Those damn Valkyries were a horror show. Each one more awful than the one before. Each one more deadly and dangerous. Ah! 
definitely one of the more stressful points of that game. Did we get this one? No, we didn't. So here's a Nornir chest. Yeah, of course we can't see it yet. But this one's not too hard. It took a minute, but it's not the end of the world. This one is the style that requires you to light the uh, brazers on fire, so... We got three brazers. We go around back of the place and you can get that lit up first. Then we need to do the old L2, R2, boom. Get one lit up. There's another one up front here. Much easier to access this one. As I miss. And the last one is up there. And the only way to get that one is with the axe. As you can see, now we can read the benefits and get ourselves another horn. Bringing us one step closer to upgrading our rage levels. I think that is pretty much all that random stuff. So we got two major things to do. One of them is, uh, like I said, a mini boss fight, and the other one is over here fighting these damn Grims that just suck. <laughs> they really do. They are awful. When you get up here, don't miss this over here. And you heard the raven. All right, let's get that out of the way. We'll get that raven. That's 13 down. him really good. Yeah, the trick is to really keep moving. You tell you, if you haven't enabled auto pickup, do it. Jackass. All right, we're finally done. That was a lot of them. Yeah, it was. I ain't lying, kid. This game definitely, uh, requires a bit of health management and that's one of the things we're going to be looking for in our armor sets and all that so as we progress we're going to want some kind of ability or 
something <clears throat> to be able to help us out with healing because as you can see in these long battles uncharacteristically indecisive of you I have a favorite poem already one from my homeland here we go belt of radiance I think that gives us the full uh, radiant armor set you can get out here we'll check when we go visit Sindri the last piece may be behind let's have it you mentioned you had a favorite poem. The boss fight, I don't remember. What was it about? A cunning general. A war over forbidden love. I believe I've heard of this one. Did it involve a horse that was not as it appears? Yes. But that is not what happened. Oh, it's based on truth then. And you were there. Yes. I prefer the poem. <laughs> Alright, we're heading over to see Sindri right now. Before we go fight that last guy that's in this area. I don't think I missed anything. I think I got everything that we can hit up in this area. If I miss something that you know of, leave a comment down below. I mean, we are coming back later on in the game. So, I think we revisit most, if not all, of the realms at some point. In different ways, so... And sometimes you can come back, even if uh, the game doesn't prompt you to, I was able to come back here and go to Schwartelheim once I got another ability that I don't have right now. It's an ability or a piece of equipment, something like that. And so it allowed me to access some stuff I couldn't reach yet. So let's go talk to Sindri. Lovely crystal sure. those elven gifts you found. I'll be yeah. happy to pay you for them. Cool. Alright, well How let's do I this. Help? So we cannot upgrade the axe, and we cannot upgrade the blades. Our shield... Shield strikes and this consume the ailment, causing a damaging element explosion. You know what? I kind of like this one better. All right, so first things first, let's go to special items and let's make one of these because we're probably going to need it. Can't do anything with that. Now, was there something else? Yes, there was actually. We're going to look at armor. Heat up the forge. All right, so we're using this uh, Nedevalier's finest armor. Let's upgrade it. It fits. So I like it because the stun grabbing of an enemy grants a health burst. So that's a help. We're talking about getting health. That's one way to do it. The arm guards. Huh. Upgrade those a little that bit. Might be my best piece yet today. And we can't do these yet. We're short both on Dwarven Steel and Hacksilver. Oh, we're so close on both. That sucks. All right. Well, that's Want that. In particular? We can sell at least. That'll get us Did the... You, uh... um, disinfect these? It's fine. I'll do it. Yeah, you'll do it. All right. Well, that gave us enough uh, Hacksilver, I'm sure. Yeah. Have we more to talk about? Have we? Yeah, why not? Let's nice let him talk. To see you out here, Sindri. I must hate the sand. Oh, it is the worst. But with Brock banned from Alfheim, it's up to me to keep you ship shape and sharp. So why is Brock banned from Alfheim? Oh, that's um, I don't know if. Well, do you know what a juicy nokin is? No. Well, thanks to Brock, the elves sure do. Uh, what is a juicy? No. Okay, now that's funny. It sounds almost like a uh, like an urban dictionary thing. All right, yeah. Let's check things out here real quick. So we got a light runic attack. We don't have a heavy. Um, we can upgrade this. Uh, 
Blades of Chaos. We can upgrade that. Shield. Yeah, I kind of wanted to... What? All right, that is equipped. All right, so that's done. Spartan Rage. We can't even think about upgrading the Relic. We got this. Grants a bonus to melee damage. Grants a burst of rage and applies stun to nearby enemies. You know, I don't use these enough. Um, I really should use them more. Uh, chest armor. Yeah, I think we're just going to stick with what we have. The belt of radiance. Alright, and for our buddy here... He's got an empty accessory slot, so lethal detonation, you're in. And those two can be upgraded, but I don't know if I want to do that right now. Uh, skills, let's take a look at these real quick. We can buy, okay. able to buy a couple skills. Oh, and we can also uh, do that. Look at that. Leaves us with one XP. How about for a trace? Let's go ahead and... Ah, oh, that's it, huh? Okay. Well, we got his skills upgraded, so we're about the best and strongest we can be at this point in time. I'm going to try and take this guy on. I'm trying to remember if we beat the last one in Svartalheim. I believe we did after much consternation. These guys are not easy. In fact, nothing in this game is really easy. <laughs> you like that maneuver? All right. Is this the spot right here? Yep, this is it. This is where we're going to die. But we do have a resurrection stone, so that's going to be a help. Oh, that hurt. So the trick is to kind of control the fight and keep him back a little bit. Oh no, we can't go that far. Try to unload on him a little bit here. Oof. Yeah, I'm on fire. I know it. Oh my god, we're gonna die. Well, we got him more than halfway done, but damn. Let's try and get a health burst here. Another little health here. And it's a little more. Ah! Oh. Alright. We'll get as much of this in on him as we can. 
Come on. Die. Oh, we got him. Oh. All right, so yeah, we did close the other one, so that's two of six done for a chaos spark. Oh, pain in the butt. But, good news is, that's it for this area. Bad news is, we need another resurrection stone. But I'm glad we had it. Alright, Sinji, we're on our way back, and we are pretty much done with Alfheim for the moment. And this game does take some interesting turns in it later on, and I'm not going to spoil anything right now. You guys are welcome just to come along for the journey and see for yourselves, but... Excuse me, things I really didn't expect. What something I did hope for happened... At least for now, so here we go. All right. And I remember at any time. Atreus, you're looking awfully tall today. Sindri. Whatever you need, I'll create. I still can't fix the... In on me? Oh, yeah. Not only that, but we want... What can I make another one me? of these. Expensive. I am, as always, at your service. But worth it. Alright, let's go back. So, we want to go to Midgard... Sindri's house. Well, I hope Tears had enough time to find his equilibrium or whatever. Indeed. I saw flashes of the old god of war in them, but they were fleeting. There is nothing wrong with opposing war, nor opposing prophecy. I suppose that's fair. If I can't be quite sure what the Giants meant by any of it. Am I the only one that remembers they predicted our entire journey to Jotunheim? If the Giants saw Tyr leading armies at Ragnarok, then I believe them. The question is, how you'll ever make Tyr believe it? Hmm. Tyr's been a disappointment, I'll tell you that. Hey, buddy. What's up, Brock? You know what he's putting in that so-called stew of his, don't you? Vegetables! Fucking vegetables! From out of the dirt! That just ain't right. <laughs> I never said that. <laughs> you can't help but love Brock. Here is... the display case for all the poems. I guess we can't read them yet, or look at them yet in there. Me in your mind, I'm as good well, let's have an awkward family meal. Eat. Oh, careful, careful. Thank you. Enjoy. Enjoy, my friends. Yeah. We'll see about that. Here you are. A meal fit for a champion. 
Enough. I said we would speak no more of that. Yes, of course. Didn't mean to offend. Uh, I'm not offended. It's just a word. A word that clouds your judgment. So, you really don't think it means anything? After the journey Mom sent us on? Everything we saw in Jotunheim? What was it all for? Don't you ever think about that? Every day. But I cannot believe her purpose was to inspire you to take foolish risks. But what if the giants are counting on me? What giants? I am counting on you. To be safe. To be smart. But... Use the judgment of a man and not of a child. But what if Loki going to Ironwood is the only way that... You oh, Atreus. My son. And nothing more. Do you hear me? I'm not hungry anymore. Uh, forgive me, Kratos. My words were chosen carelessly. Oh, boy. You really should eat. <coughs> Some people swear by it. On almost a daily basis. I just don't understand. Why is there all this stuff about Loki and, and the champion and Ironwood if none of it's real? He's just so... Ugh! Ah, Sindri. Mind if I give you the best advice you've heard all day, and possibly ever? Sleep. That's when all the troubles of your mind work themselves out. Sure. Fine. Sleep? Sounds great. I mean it. I do too. Get out of here, Ivy. Already gone. <laughs> I love the way he holds his hand out like it's infected now. Gotta love these quiet character moments in this game. Bad about killing so many elves. Hmm. What's going on? Was that a mask? I mean, just knowing we're gods makes me feel so much stronger. Where am I? I like this part. It's all you ever talk about, over and over. Feel something about it or shut up or it. Little people's little we're problems. We're sick of hearing about little people's little problems. That was a brutal Memories. moment. And not nice ones. You broke the gate! That was our only way to Yonan! What do you want? Let's go! Uma! I don't understand! Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. 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 Hey! Don't run off! Whatever. Can you tell me Whatever. where I am? Whatever. 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 Whatever, 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 whatever. Will you stop? 
I gotta get out of here. Man, you ain't lying, kiddo. He should pay for what he said about mother. Oh, oh man. But we're God. We oh. can do whatever this. we want. Please, please wait. Please. These callbacks to the last game are just fantastic. Why is this happening? This is a much better knife than That's an excellent question, young man. Anchorman. Baxter? What? I don't speak Spanish. All right. So thanks for joining me, everyone. This has been another episode of God of War Ragnarok. As always, I'm Captain Beefy with the Game Vault. If you enjoyed this video at all, please leave a like on it. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, today would be a great time to do so. I'm doing these videos daily. You can keep up with the story and um, see where Atreus is going. This is our second time playing as him solely. And let me tell you, this is a bit of a, a long stretch without Kratos. So it's very, very interesting. I'll see you next time. Until then, peace.